Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some International Delight iced coffees. We have the vanilla, the Reese's, the Hershey's chocolate caramel, and the mocha. These were $3.56 each at Walmart, and they were in the refrigerated section where you see the milk. We have already shaken the containers before we started filming. We also already have some ice in our glasses. Because they all say add ice. Add ice, so uh, we're gonna add ice. Um, says some like it hot. Try our coffee creamers and all your favorite flavors. Well, we've tried the coffee creamers. Let's see. Uh, made with real milk and cream. Uh, shake well, keep refrigerated, five servings in the container, 12 ounces, 360 milliliters is 180 calories. Uh, coffee is our number one ingredient. Flavor is our number one obsession. No artificial flavors, no corn syrup, no carrageenan. Um, add iced coffee to your iced coffee. Pour into ice cube tray freeze and then you can put the ice cubes into your coffee instead of this. So that's what those pictures are, it's little shaped ice. I was wondering what that little Yeah, that's was. really yeah. cool uh, that uh, you could do that. Okay, so you have to pull the tab on these. Okay, so this is gonna be the vanilla. It's a chocolate color for vanilla. <laughs> Definitely coffee. Yeah, it mainly just tastes like, uh, to me, I don't get a lot of vanilla. I do get a little bit though. It's not, it, the strongest thing in there is the coffee. Oh yeah, it's coffee and it's got a, almost a bitterness from the coffee. Yes, it's, yeah. to me, that is like a black coffee. It, it, there is. There's a little bit of vanilla there though. A little, yeah, yeah. it's not a lot. It's, um, I wouldn't mind <laughs> to drink it, but I wouldn't want to drink it all the time just because I want my coffee sweeter than that. Yeah. Yeah, it's not Yours bad. Too. Oh yeah, it's it's not bad. Just know that it's um, it is going to be a little uh, go a little bit. Of okay, so uh, if you want to go ahead and open those, you can, so that we don't have to wait for me to pull the tab on all these because we have already shaken them. Like I said, let's see if they're all the same calories. This is uh, twelve ounces is one hundred seventy calories, and this is says it's like having Reese's peanut butter cups in your mug. Huh. We will see, yeah, we'll especially see. since I just had a Reese's. We'll see if uh, if it actually tastes like a Reese's peanut butter cup. It's, um, I do get what they're saying about it being peanut butter. It I does do. have, but it has like an artificial peanut butter flavor. It, um, it oh still God. has that, um, underlying, uh, coffee flavor. When we bought these, I thought, oh, we can see if the, the grandkids like these. The grandkids aren't going to drink it. No, because they do <laughs> genuinely taste like coffee. Um, and people uh, like iced coffee. I, I do think it tastes like peanut butter and chocolate. Does it remind me of a Reese's cup? No, because the coffee's strong. The coffee's it, really strong. It reminds me more of um, uh, coffee that you stuck peanuts in. Okay. I can appreciate that, yeah. Because you know how some people add peanuts to their beer? This tastes like a coffee with peanuts. Right. Like you're eating peanuts while you're drinking coffee. I personally have never <laughs> tried peanuts and beer, but Kevin's told me about it forever. Uh, this is the Hershey's Chocolate Caramel, and it is 170 calories for 12 ounces. It tastes like Hershey's. Uh, it, if it tastes like Hershey's, keep your glass half full is what it says. What it's I'm, better. What I'm mainly getting from that though is the caramel. The caramel, and it tastes like a burnt. Yes, caramel. it's a burnt. It's a cooked burnt caramel. Um, it's not a sweet caramel. Honestly, none of these. That's something they all have in common. None of them are really sweet. No. You don't go away thinking, oh, that's sweet like a candy bar. You know, when you think of 
uh, Reese's Cup, you're thinking sweet. Hershey's, you're thinking sweet. These all have a bitterness to them. Even from coffee, from a coffee standpoint, they're not a really sweet coffee. No, yet. not at all. They're okay. I mean, I could drink them if, if, I, if I really wanted to. But, but would I choose to? I wouldn't choose to necessarily. And we've tried some of these international, like there's another video. They were in a can, weren't they? I'm, I'm pretty, they so. were in a can. I'll take like, them with, yeah, just take them with you kind of thing. And this is the mocha, and it's 180 calories. Coffee is our number one agree. Okay, that says the same thing as the vanilla. That's the best one. I agree. I was waiting because I wasn't going to say anything. I don't ever like to influence Kevin. No, that's 100% the best one. Yes, it is. That one actually tastes like coffee that you put um, Nestle Quick in. I agree. That is the It's the best sweetest one. and less bitter. And honestly, I would have thought this would have been the most bitter, the mocha. And it's not. I, I can't, I'm glad you thought that too. Because no, I, thought, I thought that is the best one, definitely. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, that one actually comes across as a, as a really good uh, it's sweeter. A really good flavor. And I think it's just missing the bitterness is why it seems sweeter. Yeah. It's just missing some of the bitterness. Mm -hmm. When you add bitterness to something, it, do, it doesn't come across as a sweet coffee. Right. Um, even a strong coffee, if you if you put sweetener in there and it's still really bitter, it doesn't seem like you've got enough. Right. That one's the least bitter, so I think that's the, yeah, 100% the best one. Well, if I had to put them in order, I'm going to say the mocha number one. 100%. And then I'm going to put the vanilla as Me number too. two. Yeah. Good. And then the other two uh, with the I, names on them. I didn't like the scorched caramel. And I, I didn't even like get that them. peanut flavor. No, no. And that's that's not what you wanted to hear. You know, if you're watching the video, you're thinking, oh, Reese's and yeah, Hershey's. What the fancy ones. Um, no, those are the ones that, that I would not get again. Uh, this isn't something we typically buy anyway. It's We're a lot of calories for what, for, mm -hmm. to drink. For us, yes, Cause, cause we don't we try drink to cut, our, yeah. yeah, we try. I'd rather eat my a candy bar than yes, than, than, than have 170 calories or 180 calories. This, I'd rather have an actual Reese's cup for 180 calories. Exactly. So, so um, that's why we choose. And, and yeah. these, I wouldn't choose to drink because they are bitter. But I would drink the mocha one if I were to buy one. Yeah. I would go drink that. If mocha. if you were to spend the night with at somebody's house and they were to have the mocha for you to drink in the next day in the morning, then I would totally have that. Mm -hmm. Uh, but I, I, it's just not something we buy ourselves. But just know, they, we have seen these in the can because we reviewed some of them. Um, but I hope you enjoyed the video. If you've tried these, let us know what you think of them. Is it something that you buy on the regular? Because uh, somebody's buying them because they've, they've been selling them for a long time. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.